Dressing for the summer can be lackluster to say the least, but after watching this video to the end, I can promise you that ain't gonna be you. You're watching a Johnny Ty video, I got your back. So welcome to another summer outfits video. Let's get started with outfit number one. Okay, so this has kind of been my vibe lately, the Stormtrooper look. You guys know I love that grayscale look, but this one is strictly just black and white. So let's start with the top. Y'all know I've been wearing this all summer because I'm in Las Vegas and I swear to you, it hit 120 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, that's about 49C for those of y'all across the pond and basically everywhere else in the world. This sleeveless tee, but in white is mandatory. So fortunately, when I filmed this, it was a bit of a cooler day. It was about 88 degrees. And the way I dress for summer is based on temperature, weather, and what I'm going to be doing that day. So anyways, this is the sleeveless tee from Abercrombie. They call it a tank top. I will die on that hill. It's called a sleeveless tee, okay? And to contrast that, we are going to be rolling with these Japanese Hakama style pants from Traject by Idol Ido. This is great for summer as it's a very wide fit pants. It's also cropped so you get a lot of airflow. And because it's not crazy hot, 88 is still pretty warm, but not scorching. So therefore, I decided to roll with some Guidi boots just to embrace a unique silhouette with the wide fit to a very slim fit boot. Now, if it's anything above 110, I'm just gonna stay inside. But if it's the 90s to the low 100s, I'm just gonna ditch the boots as a whole and just roll with some breathable sneakers, something like some Air Maxes or some simple white leather sneakers. Again, I dress based on the weather. Now, this fit is fine alone, but what really makes this a fit are the accessories. So everything has a touch of black to complement the look that I'm going for, that Stormtrooper look, a black watch strap, a black accented necklace from Lupin, the black Carhartt cap with the white white logo, the shades, and of course the quilted sling bag that adds texture. Remember fellas, the whole point of dressing for summer is you want to be able to still add layers, but you don't want to add any more heat onto you. So throwing on a top layer can be impractical if it's scorching hot outside, unless you're indoors, but something like a sling bag, some shades, a cap, a bandana, something like that that adds a layer, a color, a texture without insulating you even more, that's what you want to go for. Okay, so for this next fit, I wanted something that can handle most occasions while still looking pretty nice and a little bit put together. So let's start it off with the trousers. These are a pair of gray trousers from Olive Clothing, one of my favorite brands for trousers. This one is the Suit Balloon Trouser and it's very relaxed fitting and also breathable. So even though it's relaxed fitting, it's still a trouser and it sort of has a nice put together look. You have the pleated details as well and you just get a beautiful silhouette. So it kind of starts off very slim right around the waist and it flares out as you get to the bottom and you can get a lot of unique shape out of this. Now I'm gonna go with some simple white sneakers from 1587. This one has the gray suede heel. So this is sort of a mashup between some Scan Smiths and the Common Projects. But I like this one a lot. I'm also friends with the owners and I like supporting my friends. And their white leather sneakers, I wear them non-stop. Okay, so here's the situation. On top, we're gonna throw on this tank top from Uniqlo. This is the Airism tank top. Super breathable. Just look at how translucent it is. It stays cool to the touch. It wicks away moisture. You'd be crazy for not having this in your wardrobe. And honestly, you can probably just stick with this fit. Now, does it help to be in shape? Yeah, probably. So if you're gonna go and work on that, focus on building your shoulders and your arms. That's what sticks out from the tank top and that's what makes it look good. I'd probably suggest doing some handstand pushups, you know, light work. Now the next situation, as it cools down during the night, you have a choice. Stick with the tank top because it's still fairly warm, but just cool enough where you can throw on a top layer. Or if you know you're gonna be in your air conditioned car, air conditioned buildings all day, you can also roll with the top layer. So I'm gonna roll with a simple light pleated jacket from Isimiyaki that I got on the Japanese market. Got it at a discount because of the currency exchange. Low hack. And yeah, this especially works for the nighttime dates. And in my case, my girl gets cold even in the summertime. So this jacket is mostly for her. Now our next fit is a little more colorful, just a little bit. We're gonna start off with some burnt orange cargo pants. So this is from a brand called Story MFG, super pricey, but a lot of great silhouettes, a lot of great pieces. And I love the shape. I love the color. I think it would pair perfectly with a pleated sleeveless tee. So this one comes from the brand 3.3 Field Trip. I got it at a store called A-Land. It pairs perfectly with these pants as it's part of the monochromatic look. If you just add a bunch of white to orange, you'll get a creamish color. So therefore, it works with the monochromatic look. And then we got my longevity cap from A Choice Made, which is my brand. Stay tuned for that, fellas. I know y'all been wanting a restock. I'm working on it, all right? Just be patient. And then I have some Ray-Bans to match that monochromatic vibe. For the sneakers, we have the Fear of God basketball sneakers. I love the shape of these and how it complements these wide fit pants. Plus it works perfectly with the motif I'm going for for the fit. 
And of course, our timepiece, the D4 Meridian in Navy from the sponsor of today's video, Vair Watches. If you're looking for a timepiece that exudes elegance, is durable and versatile for your wardrobe, you've got to check this brand out. So first off, let's talk about the build quality. Featuring a scratch resistant sapphire crystal and 316L stainless steel cases, which is sometimes referred to as marine grade stainless steel. This means your watch can handle a lot of abuse and still look pristine. Let me take this off real quick. Check out this one that I got from them. Like I said, this is the D4 model, which is a dive watch. It's solar powered and navy with gold accents is my favorite color combo when it comes to a timepiece. And I personally have the 38 millimeter because I'm an ectomorph and I got tiny ass wrists. But if you have that wrist girth, <laughs> If you got thicker wrists, there are plenty of other sizing options. And if you want other designs, they don't just have dive watches. They have field watches, design watches for that luxury professional look and chronographs as well. Whatever your taste is, they have something for you and in different movements as well. So this one is a quartz movement. I like a quartz movement because it's easy to maintain. I don't ever have to change the time. It always stays accurate and reliable, but I do love an automatic as well. Like I said, whatever you like, they got you. Now this is solar powered. So six hours of sunlight provides six months of power. That's wild. You have that tactile bezel, which is very clicky and premium. It's also water resistant up to 100 meters. So you can swim with it. You can dive with it. The dive watch after all. But another thing I really appreciate about Vera watches is the interchangeable straps. So every watch you get, you get to pick two straps. That's a commitment the brand makes. So for that stormtrooper look, if I want to swap out the straps to really complement the outfits, I'll just swap the steel bracelet for the black silicone one. It's also much more comfortable. But if I want to be a little more sophisticated or I'm going out for an event, or dinner, I'll swap it back to this steel bracelet right here. So if you're looking for a clean timepiece, you guys gotta check out Vera Watches. Click that first link down in the description and thank you Vera Watches for sponsoring this video. Let's get back to it. Now this ain't one of those fits I'm gonna casually walk around outside all day. That would be a death sentence. So if that were the case, which I still don't prefer doing, here's what I'd wear if I had family visiting town. So I'd take them to the strip or I'm visiting New York City. You gotta walk around everywhere. Dressing for those occasions is completely different than staying in your air conditioned car and air conditioned buildings all day. A lot of people don't think about that. Now this fit is sort of similar to the first fits. We're gonna go for that Stormtrooper look as well. So I'd actually go for the oversized Aerism T from Uniqlo. Super breathable, stays cool to the touch. Everything about Aerism is great. And yeah, it's still a short sleeve shirt. I would probably stick to the sleeveless tee from Abercrombie, but I don't want this fit to look exactly like the first fit. So the oversized tee it is. Now everyone should have this shirt because it's just that good. It's affordable and also sort of premium for the price. For the shorts, we're gonna go with the Nike Dry Fit Challenger shirt shorts for 40 bucks you're going to get a great garment quick drying moisture wicking very breathable and it's lined so you don't gotta wear anything underneath and this has been washed many many times and it still holds up because you don't really want to be wearing this multiple times in a row it's kind of gross now i personally got the five inch inseam because i'm five foot seven it just fits better for my proportions if you're a bit taller they do have the seven inch version to fit your height proportionally so there's options for you the subtle nike logo is a nice touch and this leans a little bit more athleisure so we're gonna roll with some Air Maxes for our footwear. And on top, we're gonna roll with a cap similar to the Carhartt cap, but more technical. This one's actually water repellent and super breathable and absorbs a lot of sweat as well. And this one is from Alpaca Gear. It's just a simple black cap. And to top it off, I'm gonna bring this black leather tote bag with a bunch of ice water bottles in it, just so I can stay cool. This is a fit that's very practical. Anybody can wear it and it's not so in your face, but it still looks good. Now this next fit is an all black fit. I know, I know it's summertime, it's hot, but it's still manageable to wear. So it starts with these black cargos from Idol Idol. The cargo pockets on this one are tastefully designed, featuring multiple pockets within the cargo pockets and the pockets add shape as well, which is what I appreciate. These also have a dedicated foam pocket and you can also taper the ankle area if you want a sleeker look, if you so choose. Now on top, Simple, just the airism tank from Uniqlo, but in black. Very light, very airy, and the pants aren't too bad for the summer heat. We have on some simple Air Forces to complement the straight cut of the pants. And what's making this fit a little more interesting is the belt accessories. So our belt of choice is from Orbit Gear. Y'all know I talked about this brand a lot over the years. They've got some great stuff. This one is a quick release magnetic belt with some molly webbing. You know, you can get real cute with the molly webbing if you want. I'm not gonna do that for this video. And those molly straps are in olive, which adds a touch of color and texture to the fit. So yeah, on the side, we have a carabiner that's also from Orbit Gear, magnetic as well, easily detachable and never falls off. Then we could top it off with a simple pop of color from the cap. And honestly, I'm good with this fit. 
Now, if I'm staying indoors, I could throw on a top layer and I would throw on this Urban Revival jacket. Sort of has a technical look, very light, airy, and breathable. And this one does come cropped, so it fits my proportions a lot better. Now, this is definitely similar to the second outfits, but a lot more technical. So it just depends on what you're going for. All right, y'all, those are some more summer fits for y'all. Stay hydrated, stay cool. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. And until then, stay fly, check out Vare Watches, deuces.